Thursday, February the 23rd, 2023. The killer of a celebrated Los Angeles rapper was sentenced Wednesday after a legal drama that dragged on for three years. Eric Holder Jr., 33, will likely remain in jail for the rest of his life for the murder of Nipsey Hussle. Hussle, born Emmy is Joseph Asgdom, was a Grammy-nominated rapper, entrepreneur and philanthropist who was fatally shot in 2019 outside the Marathon clothing store he owned in South LA. He was 33 years old. Holder was sentenced to 50 years to life for his role in the killing as well as 10 years for shooting two other people that day. Superior Court Judge H. Clay Jack who handed down the sentence to Holder in Los Angeles. I am very mindful of what was presented as to Mr. Holder's mental health, Jack said. According to the Associated Press, I am also mindful of the devastation caused to the victims and their families. I believe this sentence balances the two. Jack sentenced Holder to 25 years to life for the murder, an additional 25 years for a firearm sentencing enhancement, and 10 years for assault with a firearm, the AP reports. Last July, a Los Angeles County jury also found Holder guilty of two counts of attempted voluntary manslaughter, as two other men were injured in the gunfire. Nipsey Hussle the LAPD and the inescapable trap of gang affiliation. Growing up, Hussle had been involved in the same gang as Holder, and prosecutors said Holder shot the rapper multiple times, because Hussle called Holder a snitch. Hussle had become a leading advocate against gun violence, and a community leader who was involved in developing his neighborhood and creating opportunities for kids. Prior to his murder, Hussle was scheduled to meet with L.A. Police Commissioner Steve Sober off and L.A. Police Chief Michelle Moore about ways to stop gang violence across the city. Last August, Hussle was honored posthumously with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame on what would have been his 37th birthday.